Is it visible? What I write is visible? Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Okay, we will uh, start with uh, a slight introduction to what writing is. Um, you might have uh, taken many classes at your university about writing skills and how to improve writing skills. Um, yet there are certain technicalities that we need to understand that we need to know. And uh, there are certain rules and regulations that we need to get ourselves aware of. Uh, and as long as we have not got that awareness regarding that writing system, no matter how much we read and how much we gain knowledge, it's always difficult to express that knowledge in words, right? So in order to give expression to your knowledge, to your ideas, the only thing that you need is to have a very good writing skills and, and a very good command of the writing, right? Um, this class will be particularly discussing all those aspects of writing that you actually need. And uh, it will also enlighten you with the uh, modern writing styles, particularly when you are writing uh, essays or the academic writing. So for that, it, it, it's going to be very much important, right? There are certain mistakes that we make while writing and these like they don't look like they don't seem to us as they are mistakes, but they are mistakes, right? So we also need to uh, focus that and lots of things are there, right? Um, when we talk about skill, English language has got four skills. Um, reading, writing, speaking, and listening, right? These are the four skills that English language has got. Um, with that, um, if we divide these four skills into uh, two major skills, we have got primary skills, and secondary skill. Primary skill uh, are listening and speaking. And then secondary skill are reading and writing. There, okay. Then um, there is another yardstick on which we divide uh, these skills and they are as uh, productive skills and receptive skills. Receptive skill and productive skill. Okay. Receptive skills are the skills in which we receive and they are reading and listening, reading and listening. So in reading and listening, we receive, while productive skills are those in which we produce, right? So we produce in um, writing and speaking. Do remember this thing, Claire? Writing and speaking, we do what we do, we produce it. And reading and listening, mein kya karte what we do in reading and listening, we receive knowledge, right? Okay. Um, before we start, we have to discuss what we are going to discuss in this class, right? So the first and foremost thing is uh, to identify words, right? Aapko words ko identify karna hai. So is me hamare pas noun aate hai. We've got pronouns. We've got adjectives. And then verb. Adverb. Conjunction. Prepositions. And interjections. These are the eight classes of words, right? The eight words ki classes hai, jo ke, uh, 
हम अपनी राइटिंग सिस्टम में यूज करते हैं ठीक है नाउन कैन बी एनी नेम लाइक डॉक्टर ऑफ एनी थिंग एनी पर्सन एनी एनिमल प्लेस quantity um quality title title is already written right um idea feelings and imaginative entities like god right so ye jo hai ye noun hai isi tarah pronoun jo hai to it's actually a replacement of noun right it uh, replaces a noun isi noun ko replace karta hai theek hai for example if i say erica loves chris erica loves chris right so um now i want to talk about erica and i use she is from canada so the word she is replacing erica and that's what you call pronoun right isi tarah adjectives jo hai ye kya hai these are like they modify nouns right noun ye noun ko modify karte hain theek hai if i say a boy right a decent boy right so this these the word decent is an adjective that is modifying a noun similarly if we talk about verb वर्ब क्या करता है इट एक्चुअली शोज एक्शन और स्टेट किसी चीज की हालत शो करता है और एक्शन शो करता है ठीक है फॉर एग्जाम्पल ही ही रंस he runs fast or or he runs simply and then he seems shy here so dekhiye jo first sentence mein verb hai hamare paas ye hame action show kar raha hai dusre mein jo verb hai ye hame state show kar raha hai that's what verb does right isi tarah adverb hai adverb kya karta hai it aids to the meaning of verb adjective another adverb and a complete sentence right so ye jo hai ye uh, in sab cheezon mein addition karta hai for example um if i say to vesa um speaks loudly isi tarah uh, john is extra ordinarily smart or uh, alex speaks uh to slowly right and then uh david teaches english comprehensive comprehensively okay 
So you see here the word loudly is adding something to the meaning of a verb speaks. यहाँ पे स्पीक को हमें थोड़ा सा और बता रहा है स्पीक के बारे में इसी तरह जो स्मार्ट है ये एजेक्टिव है तो इस स्मार्ट के बारे में जो हमें एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डिनरी है ये हमें बता रहा है ठीक है इसी तरह स्लोली इज अगेन एन एडवर्ब राइट इस को कौन मॉडिफाई कर रहा है टू मॉडिफाई कर रहा है और डेविड टीच इज इंग्लिश इज अ कम्प्लीट सेंटेंस राइट और इसको ये जो वर्ड है कॉम्प्रिहेंसिवली ये मॉडिफाई कर रहा है ठीक है सो दिस इज हाउ एन एडवर्ब फंक्शन राइट इस तरह जो है एक एडवर्ब वर्ड को वर्ब को एजेक्टिव को एडवर्ब को या कंप्लीट सेंटेंस को मॉडिफाई करता है ठीक है ओके फिर हमारे पास जो है कंजंक्शन है कंजंक्शन ऑब्वियसली जॉइंस राइट इट जॉइंस जॉइंस वर्ड्स फ्रेजेस एंड क्लॉजेस राइट वर्ड्स फ्रेजेस और क्लॉजेस को जॉइन करता है ठीक है फॉर एग्जाम्पल लीसा एंड जैसिका Lisa and Jessica, two words joined by conjunction, right? Similarly, um, he will be inside the room or in the park. He'll be inside the room or in the park, right? So inside the room is a phrase and in the park is also a phrase. And these two are joined by or and that's what you call um, conjunction right here it's again and similarly um, they will be free but they will never answer you they'll be free but they will never answer you right ab yahan pe ये जो हमारे पास है दे विल बी फ्री ये क्लॉज है ठीक है और दे विल नेवर आंसर यू इज अगेन एन अदर क्लॉज राइट और इन दो क्लॉज को ज्वाइन किया है बट ने दैट्स वॉट यू कॉल कंजंक्शन राइट इसी तरह प्रपोजिशन जो है ये आपको टाइम पोजिशन ऑफ नाउ or a pronoun with the rest part of a sentence jumle ke baki hisse ke sath ye jo hai position show kar ye position place wise bhi hoti hai time wise bhi hoti hai direction wise bhi hoti hai theek hai for example they are going to swat This is direction. He lives in Swat, place-wise, and they will return in winter. This is time-wise, right? So, ye in, on, to, by, with, ye sare kya hai? Ye preposition hai, theek hai? And this actually shows us our sudden emotions, right? सडन इमोशंस शो करते हैं ठीक है फॉर एग्जाम्पल साइन ऑफ एक्सक्लेमेशन ओके सो दीज आर वर्ड क्लासेस सो आई वॉन्टेड टू हैव अ वेरी शॉर्ट इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ देम ताकि आपको थोड़ा सा आइडिया रहे कि ये चीजें क्या है ठीक है ओके अब हम आते हैं सेंटेंस पे सेंटेंस क्या है इट्स एक्चुअली अ ग्रुप ऑफ वर्ड्स that always gives complete meaning sentence jo hai ye ek aisa group of word hota hai jo ki aapko hamesha 
कंप्लीट मीनिंग देगा और अगर वो कंप्लीट मीनिंग नहीं देता एंड इट इज अ ग्रुप ऑफ वर्ड्स इट इज नॉट अ सेंटेंस यू कैन नॉट कॉल इट अ सेंटेंस बिकॉज इट डजेंट गिव यू कंप्लीट मीनिंग तो जब तक कंप्लीट मीनिंग नहीं होगा वो सेंटेंस नहीं होगा ठीक है फॉर एग्जाम्पल जैसन लाइक्स फुटबॉल Now, this is a complete sentence, right? Because it gives you complete meaning. अच्छा जी अब हम सेंटेंस को डिवाइड करते हैं दो बेसिस पे ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ मीनिंग जब आपको आवाज नहीं आती है ग्लिचेस होती है या कुछ भी मसला होता है सो प्लीज लेट मी नो हा ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ मीनिंग and on the basis of structure structure ke base pe aur meaning ke base pe hum sentence ko divide karte hain theek hai meaning ke base pe hamare paas jo sentence hota hai wo hamare paas hota hai declarative sentence isi tarah हमारे पास होता है इंट्रोगेटिव सेंटेंस इंपेरेटिव सेंटेंस एटिव सेंटेंस नेटिव सेंटेंस राइट ओके ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर स्ट्रक्चर के बेस पे हमारे पास जो सेंटेंसेस होते हैं वो हमारे पास होता है सिंपल सेंटेंस कंपाउंड सेंटेंस कॉम्प्लेक्स सेंटेंस कंपाउंड complex sentence periodic sentence analytic sentence absolute statement Right, so that's how we divide a sentence into two. Right. यहाँ तक कोई मसला हो तो please ask me so that I can move. Shavash, quick, Gula. Please ask me about. Look. the problems if you have any or if there is any confusion yeah yeah you have raised hand if you have any problem please ask me am i audible sir ji ji the exclamatory noun or interjection is a sort of farak peda ho mung tadwana सडन इमोशन और फीलिंग्स दा कई शो कई कन अगो गुरा चे इंटरजेक्शन शी देन दा गई तालुक वर्ड सरे दे और एक्सक्लेमेटरी सेंटेंस तालुक सेंटेंस सरे दे संगे चे दा स्ट्रक्चर खबर को मुमकन ना वी हैव गॉट स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ वर्ड सो मॉर्फोलॉजी डील्स विद दैट एंड देन वी हैव गॉट स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ सेंटेंस सो सिंटैक्स डील्स विद दैट डिड यू गेट इट 
نو انٹرجیکشن چی دے دا آغی تعلق مارفولوجی سر دے اور اکسکلیمیشن چی کم دے اکسکلیمیٹری سینٹنس دا آغی تعلق چی دے آغا سینٹیکس سر دے ایزا کلیر؟ اوکی سو جی 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 حمید شیراز سر کھوڑی ریپیٹ فرام دی بگننگ لائک فرام سینٹنس در گروپ آپ پر لائی دیر اور گارڈ بکار مائی لائٹ گولا بدا ست در لون خوڑ خیرات تنی را گلی چی پا دویم دویم زل وی در توی ما ریکارڈنگ با در سر شیر کما اوکی Question, can we know question? Okay, Shabash. No question? Haris? No, sir, it's not. Okay, good. What's the result of the Haryotype explanation? Declare it. Singa? Okay, sir. So, like, we can go ahead. Okay. Declarative sentence is a sentence. That makes. That's all that is going to be done. Which is the next topic. No, sir. Explain. Okay, sir. Voting, please. Yeah, explain it, sir. We would like to learn from you. Ha, sir. Narazi. Say it, say it. A sentence that makes a statement. They use statement work. I say, Shwa. For example, Humpty sits on a wall. Right. Humpty sits on a wall. It's a statement, right? The other declarative sentence you did, that put two types, Kirazi. Yotawai, positive statement, your positive sentence, or Baltawai, negative sentence. Positive sentence or negative sentence. Say sure. Positive sentence is. Uh, Making a positive statement like I love play is a positive sentence. Negatives gives you a negative meaning like I don't love to play. Shobula, ha. That's it. Yeah, interrogative. They no interrogative today. It asks questions. It asks what? Questions, right? Um, what's the questions types, Dimungsara? Now, how many types of questions do we have? Does anybody know? Please respond to me. The question sumra types, Dimungsara. Hmm. That is the chai will you. دوبارہ لنک شیئر کوم خواہ یا کمون ٹین منٹس کی دمرہ سو ویل نو بس بیا دوبار لنک نشیئر کوم گورا قویسن چی دے مونگ سرا مختلف ٹائپس کی رازی سی شوا پا دے کی مونگ سرا رازی پولر قویسن دیز آر امپورٹنٹ خواہ پولر قویسن پولر قویسن ہاگا قویسن تو وی چی دا کم نیڈز یس اور نو ایزا ریسپونس 
तो रिस्पॉन्स की वर्ता यस या द नो जरूर रखी सही शो फॉर एग्जाम्पल आर यू हैप्पी आर यू हैप्पी नो आर यू हैप्पी जिले द कम क्वेश्चन दे द पोलर क्वेश्चन दे सही शो दगर से बिया नॉन पोलर क्वेश्चन भी डू यू ऑल अंडरस्टैंड पश तो आई बिलीव यस सर नॉन पोलर क्वेश्चन Non-polar questions the way uh, a question that needs a question that needs an explanatory answer. The data the explanatory explanatory answer is required. We say sure it is not like yes or no. For example. Um, Where do you live? Was the day per answer? Can you tell us yes or no? No, why? You have to come up with an exhaustive explanatory answer, right? Or why do you smoke? Why are you happy? Why are you laughing? How is the world? Where do you live, right? Now these are non-polar questions, and they need explanation. Tishwa, ha. Bal mung sara de. um um which question dichotomous dichotomous question is a question that has two possible answers right for example agree disagree true false That questions को बताओ सुना मैं खिलेरा गली का ना true false agree disagree yes no now these are dichotomous question right दरअसल सिबिया divert question भी divert question divert question से तो वही a question that has more than two possible answers right for example the mcq strip communicana no di kisi bhi di kitab se tar se lower options andar polish shpagam andar polish ya ziyad andar polish sahi tha the divert questions the इन्फॉर्मेशन जो खबर तासु कंफर्म कवर वाड़ी जब आप एक बात को कंफर्म करवाना चाहते हैं तो उसके लिए आप टेक क्वेश्चन यूज करते हैं इट इज आल्सो यूज इन उर्दू उर्दू में भी यूज होता है पश्तो में भी यूज होता है और इंग्लिश में भी यूज होता है ठीक है उर्दू में आप कहते हैं आज मौसम अच्छा है, है ना So this henna is what? It's a take question. आज मौसम अच्छा है, है ना? Right? इसी तरह पश्चतो में आप कहते हो नन हो समा समसे समा यखनी दा है ना? So this henna is a 
take question in Pashto, right? So uh, similarly, like you use these structures in English and Pashto too, but we do not have proper word for these type of questions in Urdu and Pashto, but we have it in English, right? English me apketeho. It is cold today. It is cold today, isn't it? Right? So this isn't, it is what? It's a tech question. I believe it is clear. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, do remember one thing, the tag question, the power rule that day, she kalatasusara, the dio statement positive V, nudaba negative V. There was a first statement negative V, for example, they are not happy. They are not happy. Use the negative V, nudaba negative V. Are they clear? They are not happy, are they? Okay, which they are happy. Maybe I've been trying to take question the so aren't they? Aren't they we take question was say sure? Daga si mung sara um bul question they um rhetorical question. Rhetorical question asilki or dasi question we it's actually a question that is asked to make a statement now you that's a question which is of the your statement jewelable the para you ski it's among your statement durable world um if you want to make a statement right a question that is asked to make a statement it doesn't need any answer Either the answers are worth me because we already know the answer. See, sure. Was for example, she or Casta Sutapa Jazbatu Kirashi or Dartuichi Imran Khan will uh, will change Pakistan, Kana change Pakistan. Like Seishwa, no, this thing, like we have come to know that is impossible. They Khobiahum like a Yokasta Suto, which Imran Khan will change. Okay, those who are supporting Imran Khan, sorry if I have hurt you. But this is just for the sake of example. Khasra for example, the Rukum Nurza Master Chasra political bias Nishta. Imran Khan will change Pakistan. No Osio Kaswartu which Mula say like like gap like can no Agabu or Nayo rhetorical question to post with Kichi can um elephants fly can elephants fly? No, gura that question. Kavulu maksad da ne di chimung ta pate nisht di chhe elephants fly kavule shiana. But the way elephants can't fly, similarly, Imran Khan cannot change Pakistan. So this is just for the sake of making a statement. So that's your statement. Jola wale da pare yau khabar okay. No, that's what you call a rhetorical question. Is that clear? Ha, this is for a confusion, and please ask me because uh, meeting khat me do wala de shavash. Nan bangal to stop ku bhi abe sabhan ke diye nu we will have forty forty minutes class ha. Okay, sir, uh, can you please repeat the divert question? But there's a point na shoma. Divert question. Have a question which daagi answer kitas sir three choices ratleshi, four choices ratleshi, five choices rat. 